Twin Death Stars, very nice. Looks like the reactor core. Kyber Crystal? Hmm. Is he defecting already? No. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Two accounts. Oh, let's go. Oh, that's a really weird looking force power. I like how it's like um, the Luke and Leia story, but with a twist. It's almost as if Leia went and Luke were, uh, or yeah, either Leia or Luke went to the dark side and then they suddenly, and then suddenly one of them uh, decided to go back to the light. It's a pretty interesting dynamic. Is this is this sister stronger in the force? Not sure how he's uh, breathing in space though. Oh, that's a gorgeous, gorgeous shot right there. Oh shit. Power levels rising. Does he not have a lightsaber? Oh, I see. There we go. There we go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Oh no! Droids, man, droids. Always coming in clutch at the end. Whoa! That is one massive lightsaber. <laughs> Yo, these lightsabers are on steroids, seriously. Oh! Holy moly! Just, you know, casually surviving a hyperdrive jump, jump, I guess. That's Last Jedi reference right there. Tatooine, I guess. Is it Tatooine? Looks like Tatooine. Yeah, it's not bad. The the action scenes for this one is absolutely outlandish though, I have to say. It's absolutely outlandish, but it's it's really interesting how they managed to sort of balance between that sort of ridiculous outlandish action style of anime will keep it still somewhat within the Star Wars uh, DNA. Like there's a lot of Star Wars story beats inside this episode. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh, this definitely can be can canon, so... Uh... <laughs> Hello there, hope you've enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe, and if you're interested, be sure to check out my other videos on this channel. As always, I am the Lost Acolyte, and I have spoken.